Oh my god, a tiger. But they live in India, right? These types. Of It's already gone. Or is it but there is a Ten tiger! Welcome everyone to another movie reaction. My name is Jeroen, better known as Dutch Bond fan. And joining me once again is my lovely girlfriend, Lirit. Hi! <laughs> Today we are watching 1983's Octopussy, the sixth Roger Moore movie. Um, you seem to have been enjoying particularly his last, well, three, I would say. The Spy You Love Me, Moonraker, For Your Eyes Only. You enjoyed each of those mainly. Yeah. Are you getting tired of Roger Moore yet? No, but I think he's getting older. Yeah, you're very right about that. Um, that this is a common critique he, his later movies uh, are getting because now especially he's he's getting really old in Octopussy and the next one because he did seven Bond films. So how many uh, years in between? Each time there's two years in between, pretty much. Only two years. Yeah, back then they made them really fast. Uh, the the first two there was only one year in between. Uh, between Live and Let Die and The Man with the Golden Gun, yeah. But um, Octopussy, just a little quick uh, expectation. What are your expectations when you hear the title and what are your expectations for the movie? <coughs> <laughs> Octopussy. Yeah, what do you think? I think it's in the sea. <laughs> With an octopus, but I don't know. <laughs> no clue. No, maybe with a Bond girl, I don't know. Yeah. You, mean, you think the Bond it's, girl might be named Octopussy? It could be, but it's quite kind of, kind of weird. Yeah, it's a typical Bond title, definitely. Um, so I don't know. Okay. Uh, anything else you want to mention before we dive into the film? I hope the bad guy is really good. Right. Like a sea kind of person. I don't know. I think if I hear Octopussy and I see like the poster of Octopussy, I think it's in the sea or anything. No, I see like an airplane, so... Yeah, it doesn't give away too much from this distance. No, in maybe in it particular. will collapse in the sea and then it will go underwater. Okay. Well, lots of expectations, so you can definitely <laughs> tell she has never seen this movie before. Um, if you are interested in seeing our full-length reaction, you can go to my Patreon page, become a premium member there, so you can watch the whole thing with us, synchronized with your copy of the movie. Um, and without any further ado, we are going to be watching Octopussy. Yeah. It's similar to what we've seen before, yeah. yeah. It's not that different to what I got there, this one. Another military base. This is where it kind of starts for the first time with the military bases. Horses! Oh yeah, horses! Fidel mm -hmm. Castro? Yeah, correct. I think it's supposed to be him. They don't mention it, but it's definitely supposed to be Cuba, right? Because you see, like, communist country, Hispanic, it has to be Cuba. James Bond! Yeah, it is. Huh? Did you say that? Yeah, he put it inside out and now yes. it's a different uniform. Toro sounds like a load of bull. <laughs> James. There are military... There is a military base at a horse racing... <laughs> it's, it must be in a similar location, yeah. A bar? Well, it's a small world. You're a Toro too. That 
That's a fake horse. You think so? I think so. I couldn't resist having a peek. <laughs> I'll see you in Miami. It's a fake horse, I know for sure. So what is in there then? A car. Or like a shooting thing. A shooting thing. <laughs> I didn't expect the, an airplane or no. anything. There he goes. <laughs> but I knew it was fake. Yeah, yeah. No, good call. I always mention it's like the Dutch flag on the side. <laughs> Makes it even cooler. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> That's a cool opening, right? Yeah. All those uh, military uh, people are dead. Yes, yeah, communists. Yes. <laughs> Gas? No, that's <laughs> not possible. Fill her up, please. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know the movie Ted? Ted, the teddy bear that's talking? Oh yes, in, but in Mark that, Wahlberg. Yeah, in that movie they're singing this song. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's, it's very funny to me because I, I already knew the song. It's, uh, it's a cool scene. I remember seeing it in cinema and really being in hysterics that they were singing this. So it's not in... Uh, where is it? Oh, Berlin. East Berlin! Yeah. Still the Cold War, right? Mm. 1983. He's gonna die. Lose all the stuff! Lose it! With his knife. How could he be here? What do you think? Sorry? How could he be already here when he was walking There are around? two of them. Yeah. Okay, I thought maybe you didn't notice. They're twins. Oh, he's not dead. Barely. British Embassy. What did he have? A fabric, a fabric egg? Fabric egg. You're right. Good on you that you know that. You become more beautiful every day. I am over here. <laughs> Oh, of course. <laughs> and this is Miss Penelope Smallbone, my new assistant. Miss Smallbone? Attractive and as charming. As I used to be. I... <laughs> Penny, you know there never has been and there never will be anybody but you. So you've told me. And he will give <laughs> her that. Universal. Yeah. <laughs> I take it, dear. That's all you'll ever get from him. Do you know what this is? Well, it looks like a Fabergé egg, so. They're priceless and... Uh, very rare. very rare, except it's a fake. Now there's the real thing. It's being auctioned at Sotheby's this afternoon. Oh, this is uh, Russia. <laughs> Overwhelming superiority over NATO forces before we give it away. <laughs> I'm in Czechoslovakia. In support <laughs> on the Russian wow. western border are six. Satisfy your personal paranoia and thirst for conquest. You see him? This is General Gogo. Remember him? No. The spy who loved me, he was the head of the KGB. Oh, yes. 
from Triple With X. the red uh, phone. Yeah. Be there as quickly as possible. So strange that they talk in English. Yeah, it's uh, that's always in movies. Yeah. But this is the real this one. This is the real one. Yeah. Should it fetch? Two hundred and fifty, three hundred thousand pounds. Can be more bit crazy. Which was a lot more money back then than it is now. Yes. Sixty. One seventy. That's the Bond girl. One this one? Yeah. Two hundred. Come out of car. Usually a seller. Or she's the bad guy, because they need need it back. Four twenty-five. You bid. Thank you. <laughs> Four twenty. Against you, sir. Did he swapped it? He swapped it. But what do you mean with the fake egg? Yeah, because he did like this. Under the book? Under the book. 500,000 pounds. 500,000 pounds. I have half a million pounds. He did make him pay 100,000 more. He could have been stuck with it. I doubt it. He had to buy it. But why? That's what I intend to find out. I would have claimed it was a fake, sir, and not paid. Not paid? Here's the original. I knew it! <laughs> Book yourself on the next flight out. Yes, well, I have uh, 55 minutes to catch that flight, sir. Well, and, and uh, an egg? The sign a chit for that egg before you leave the building. It's government property now. Of course, sir. He won't do it. Ah, oh, the Taj Mahal. Yeah. Ooh, a snake! Charming tune. That's him. You do take English money. Only gold sovereigns. Never been to India, but I really want to see the Taj Mahal. Yeah. It's one of the seven world wonders. It is. Good afternoons and evenings here at the Hotel Casino. As a guest, you're automatically a member. This guy, VJ, the guy that's getting off now, he's actually a real life tennis player called VJ. Oh. He's, he's playing his real name. That's why there were some tennis jokes while we were talking. That his backhand had approved. <clears throat> there is she. Oh! Octopus! So that's from uh, the bad guy. Oh, what's mm -hmm. his name? What's his name? Kamal Khan? No! The bad guy from all the movies. Oh, you mean Spectre? Yes. No, 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 no. Uh, it's actually, it makes sense that you would think that, but no, there's no Spectre in this. Damn. Always a double six when you need it. Always. How do you do it? It's all in the wrist. Oh, it's hopeless. You saw what he did? Yes, the dice yes, were rigged. Well, I would have taken that double myself. Mr. Bond. James Bond. Thank you, I'd be delighted. Of course. You can only win with a double six. What is he going to do? Think that this should be ample security. Oh. Don't you? <laughs> he did take it with him. You need a great deal of luck to get out of his player's privilege. And use your ducks. <laughs> it's all in the wrist. <laughs> he doesn't even look. Double sixes. Fancy that. <laughs> I prefer cash. <laughs> it doesn't scare him at all. <laughs> Come on. It's like an Indian uh, R job. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a special tick tuck tuck. <laughs> Step on it. Oh, oh. This should shake him off. Oh. Ah. With a racket. Yeah. Ah. 
Oh, he had the money. Well, thank God for hard currency. He had the money here, yeah. yes, sir. Hard currency. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, he's throwing all the money, so. Yeah. Huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Secret Service in India. Yeah. Q is also in yeah. India. Having problems keeping it up. <laughs> Did you get it? I don't want to get it. <laughs> Perfect image, Q. <laughs> really double O seven. Thank you for your Don't let him teach you any of his bad habits. <laughs> it's not okay. Anymore. That back then people could still laugh at jokes. The table is ready. I didn't reserve one. Your guest is waiting, sir. This way, please. The blind one, of course. I collect memories. For the men she killed. You can tell that Kamal Khan has sent her to get the egg. Of course. At all costs. But remember the egg now has the... Yes. Microphone. The in microphone. It. So, you know, Bond wouldn't care if, <laughs> if it gets stolen now. I need refilling. <laughs> Give my curiosity. It's fake. What is that? That's my little octopus. You <laughs> saw his eyes. I'll wake you. This says you're up. You can say it properly. <laughs> well, he doesn't. Yeah, he can clearly see it in the mirror. Oh, the villain thought, ooh, but he didn't expect this. No. Wow. The layer of the bad guy is very beautiful. But did you notice? What? It's only women. Yeah, it's not so much, but the layer itself is very beautiful. No, 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 you're missing the point. I'm not pleased it was stolen in the first place. Nor that the thief knows enough about us to bring it here. She's up to pussy. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, one of our specialities. Temple of Doom all over again. Stuffed sheep's head. Uh. Uh. <laughs> uh. So it's already over. <laughs> it's not as long as Temple of Doom. Oh, uh, thank you. Oh, it's his pen. Mm -hmm. Fidel Castro. No, 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 it's General Orwell. Oh! He's coming back! Oh my god, he's coming back. Oh my god, get away! Oh my god, get away, get away. Karl Marx Karl Marx. Get away from the door! Go. He saw it. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's he's in he, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, a tiger. But they live in India, right? These types of... Oh, oh spiders! <laughs> spiders! <laughs> the 
It's already gone. Or is it, but there is a Tempo tiger! Is ah! Sit! Please <laughs> go up! I never liked that bit. Tarzan reference. Yeah. A leech. Leech. Ooh, crocodiles. Yeah. <sighs> Tourists. Yeah. You all right, buddy? I'm fine. Are you with our group? No, ma'am. I'm with the economy tour. <laughs> Mr. Bond is indeed a very rare breed. Soon to be made extinct. Yeah, right. <laughs> I like him as a villain. Yes. Mr. Bond is indeed He's funny. a very rare read. <laughs> <laughs> Only in these kind of movies. <laughs> The only bond that got you, know, you can't picture Daniel Craig doing. No. <laughs> I wondered when you might arrive. She's not even Hindi. No. Double O Seven license to kill. Do you recognize her? She's from another Bond movie. Right. Do you remember which one? No. I told her to remember her face. No. She was the mistress of Scaramanga and the man with the golden gun. Ah. The one that got killed in... Ah, uh, yes. But now she's playing a, a more powerful character. Naturally you do it for queen and country. Is she mad? Why is she mad? That's the, the question I, you could always ask with women. He solves it quickly. No! You're right. We are too. That's how I will always solve my problems with you as well, right? No, you walk away. <laughs> no, that's not true. Yes, that's true. <laughs> you leave me alone and then you make up with me. <laughs> the method seems to help. <laughs> Look at her bed. Yeah, it's an octopus. Do you see? Oh, is it? I thought it was like a heart shape. Uh... No, it's an <laughs> Oh, that's cool. He's going to die. He's going to die. The assassins are here. No, no. I don't want to this. You don't see anything, it's a bomb. Have you? How did they swim through the lake with the crocodiles? With the crocodiles, I don't know. I never noticed it. I never That's also a fault. Oh! Behind you! Behind you. Something wrong? Venom! He has the octopus on his head. He's in here. Yeah? How did he get in there so quickly, though? I don't know. Better signal M to meet me in Berlin. Why? Well, I have to go to a circus in Karl Markstadt. Oh, yes, they said it. Mm -hmm. And, and this, is, this stuff is insane. Like blindfolded. Even without a blindfold, I would be, would be scared to throw. That's insane, wow. right? Wow. You could have easily been killed. Uh -oh. They don't they don't see him. What's that? That's the fake one? No, this is uh this is something else. It's a bomb. A nuclear bomb. Nuclear bomb. To activate. Insert 
and twist the lever a quarter turn clockwise. I must go. Au revoir, dear lady. Good luck. But they, they will also kill her then. She's definitely not aware of the bomb plan. Yeah. No. So they switch the bomb for the jewelry. Yeah. Sit on that box, hands on your knees. Come on, move. Why is that bomb on the train? Who are you? I would shoot him in the head in, in seconds. Everyone will assume incorrectly that it was an American bomb triggered accidentally. Oh, that would be the most plausible explanation. You're going to stop that train. Too late. Too late. I would shoot him already. Why talking to the general? Stupid. But now we do know the full plan. Well, you didn't have to ask. You already knew. <coughs> Also that uh, gets the jewelry. On the train tracks. Yeah. <gasps> but the jewelry are all in this car. Well that can be recovered. But now it's the more important thing. Stopping the bomb. So they're taking the bomb into the west. Yes, but they can't go to the west without border control. Let's How is it possible? Train. It isn't. You see? We're shooting already. A common thief. The disgrace to the uniform. But tomorrow, I shall be a hero of the Soviet Union. <laughs> Well, they need to stop this train. Yeah. The Russians don't know about the bomb, and neither do the West. It's only Bond. Like the beginning in yeah. the forest, being chased by a, a knife-throwing twin. And this for my brother. And that's for yes. 009. And they had also. <laughs> Too bad. It's there. There's the bomb. Yeah. Lotus? No. What? It's an Alfa Romeo. And this is a unique moment in Bond history. It is to me. To you it's an... Uh... There's a bomb about to go off, so what does Bond do? Uh -huh. He's driving an Alfa Romeo. GTV6. My dad had that car. Why do you always have to be so... when I'm telling you something so exciting? Okay. <laughs> it's cool. To me. To you. But I'm happy for you. <laughs> Just like double O nine. Hey, is anyone else in there? It's the only way to get in. Bond as a clown. Were you ever yeah. expecting death to see that? No. <laughs> no. Well, that bomb is set to explode at 3:45. That's 90 seconds from now. General, this man's either drunk or crazy. He has oh to do it God. himself. Yeah. Let me go, damn it! There's a bomb in there. You 
Now what I see, he's yeah. like... 12 seconds. Let him go. Just in time. Just in time. So now Octopussy realizes that Kamal would have killed her. Where was Kamal going? Back to India. But he got the face paint and everything on perfectly yes. and within like a couple seconds. of seconds. It's really weird actually, but oh well. You left me to be killed along with thousands of innocent people. Octopussy. Kill him already. Between the eyes. <laughs> Too late. I trust you can handle this contraption, Q. It goes by hot air. More <laughs> well, than you can. <laughs> it doesn't hurt him. Oh, he quickly gets rid of that would have hurt him. <laughs> I don't know what to say about this. This is some Tom Cruise stuff, right? <laughs> It is. <laughs> it's like, how did he get on the plane? First the train, now the plane. Yeah, the flaps on the tail. Well, there goes Kamal. Who would also do that for me, right, as a stewardess? What? Jump out and save me from a plane like that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would save you. I wish you weren't in such a weakened condition. <laughs> oh, James! <laughs> James! So, we finished watching Octopussy. And once again, I'm going to ask you, what are your initial thoughts after watching this film? Well, it's not underwater. No, it wasn't underwater. Like the little mermaid. Yeah. <laughs> so then so, I was wrong. Yeah. <laughs> um, but you were right about the Bond girl being named Octopussy. You did predict that one. Oh, I thought you said it. No, 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 you were the one that uh, mentioned it before this, uh, at the beginning of this video, and also at the end of the previous episode. You were like, oh, that's probably the Bond girl's name. Oh. <laughs> she, she forgot that she is I correct. Forgot. That's no, that's That's very unusual, because usually she's always very certain that she is correct. But, um... <laughs> I uh, forgot. <laughs> fair enough. Any more that you want to mention before we get into the ratings about uh. this film? No, it was very mysterious. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you could say so. It's not like spelled out immediately, like what is going on in the story. Yeah, correct. Okay, you want to get to your rating? Yeah. We're going to start again with Bond's performance. Uh, Roger Moore returning for the sixth time. How did you like him in this film? Just like the other ones, four stars. He's going to get another four stars. I'm happy to hear that because he's honestly, like you said before, he's getting Very a bit older. Old. He's getting older. I don't know how old, but he was he's, old. Yeah, he's getting, he's getting well into his 50s by this mm. point. Yeah. Um, okay. Anything yeah. more you want to mention about him? Did you find him funny in this movie? No, it was a bit too much. Mm. Yeah. With all the double meaning with his lines. It was a bit too much. Yeah. I didn't enjoy it any longer. In the mm. beginning it was fun, but 
then it was too much a for bit me. too much Roger Moore-esque jokes to you yeah what about the there's also some really badass moments like when he kills the knife throwing uh, uh, twin with yes. this is for 009 and with the dices double sixes yeah it's all in the wrist now I, that that type of stuff is really cool like he, keep, he keeps one-upping the villains in this film yeah that's so, correct um, <laughs> I'm glad you still gave him four stars regardless Moving on to the Bond girls, you could say. I, I guess it's it was mainly one, but there were a couple. Uh, what did you think? I gave them three stars. Three stars? That's very decent. Yeah. So I guess we should start with the main one where the movie was named after, Octopussy. Yeah. What did you think? Um, she did a pretty good job. Uh, they weren't like typical... Bond girls. No, not at all. So I was like, okay, but who's the Bond girl now? Because mm -hmm. I don't understand the blonde one or the female. Uh, yeah, first uh, you thought Magda may have been. Uh, yeah, but is she like bad or good? Because they were all with the bad guy yeah. all the time, but they helped Bond. So mm -hmm. I was like, you still needed to process confused. that. Yeah, she was the assistant of uh, Octopussy in the end, but she was also. A mistress to Kama, Kamal Khan, I think. Yeah, so it was a little weird. I can like understand the end, that. Bond got a whole army of females. Well, no, no, those were all linked to Octopussy. That was Octopussy's yes. army. Yeah. Yeah. So it was a little bit. Do you think it's it's cool and empowering for women that this was actually you know this was not a bimbo character this no, Bond girl no. she was like the leader of a whole cult, cult. of a yes, sisterhood said, of I women. Said it too. Yeah. yeah, it's a cult. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was. And they were all just very skilled as well and acrobatic and and. Because they were in the in the circus. Yeah, and they were able to you know deceive the men and you know using their assets Bodies. but then kicking yeah. their asses. It's uh yeah, that yes. was uh very cool I think. In that time I think in nineteen what eighty three. Eighty three. Yeah, seven years before I was born. Yeah. Anyway, um I'm glad you like the Bond girls. Uh so we're now gonna move on to the villains. There were definitely multiple villains in this movie. Yes. Um I'd say the two main ones were Kamal Khan and General Orlov. Mm -hmm. There was also Gobinda, of course, and the, the assassins, the Indian assassins. Gobinda was the 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 tulba, tulba, the, the assistant of Kamal Khan. Oh, uh, with the dices, like. Yeah. Yeah, and then there were also the knife throwing twins. So. Oh yes. Lots of villains to get into, but first her rating. Stars. Three stars for the villains in Octopussy. Well, let's hear about it. What did you think? I thought there were two villains. You're like right. you two said. main ones, yeah. yeah. And that there was one um, one villain and then the rest of them. Mm -hmm. Like Kamal. Kamal Khan. Kamal, yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. It was funny. <laughs> kind of, yeah, he has some interesting lines. Yeah. And, um, I don't know, he was pretty good as a villain. I didn't notice he was a villain in the beginning. Yeah. Was, it, was he with the Fabergé act? Yeah, in you the did not. Yeah. Was he the yeah, yeah, auction? Him. Oh, yeah. yes, and you I noticed notice him. Yeah. yeah. And then there was General Orloff. The renegade Russian general oh, yes. who wanted to take over the West and With blow the it bomb. up. Yeah. 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 I don't know what to say about them, but they did a pretty good job. So before the the video started, in the beginning of the video, you were like, "I hope for good villains." Yeah. Did that kind of meet your expectations? Is this this is kind of Bond villain as? Yeah. Okay. They did. They did everything uh, in one movie: the airplane, the train. Uh, the chase in India, the chase in what kind of country was that? Berlin. Berlin. Mm -hmm. Germany. Everything. Yeah. Also, yeah, the airplane already said that one. Yeah, cool climax. So I everything they did. Yeah, with you're bonds. right. You're right. Also, hunting him. <laughs> Yeah. With elephants. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And there were also the the Indian assassin, the guy with the saw. That, that, that oh yes, like a yo-yo. Yeah, that raided, that raided <laughs> the bed. They did everything, yeah. yes. 
So uh, and also with the that sheep. Yeah, the his, knife drawing on twins. His plate. Yeah. Oh yeah. Of course. Everything. They did everything. So they did yeah. a pretty good job. I'm glad. Moving on to the locations uh, in this film. What did you think? I gave them four stars. Four stars. Yeah. Nice. I think that's very deserving in Octopussy because, well, the main part took place in East Berlin. <laughs> but that was more then. towards the end, but much, much bigger was set in India. India yeah. Well, at the beginning they were in Cuba, I think. The the opening, yeah, it, it isn't actually in Cuba, but and it's not mentioned, but it's definitely supposed to be, you know. With Fidel Castro, yeah. I thought it was Fidel Castro. Yeah, you're right, kind of. Kind of, yeah. Yeah. And then they went to London. From London, he went to India. Yeah. And then from India to Berlin. Right. And that was the end. And in the end, was also in India. Oh yeah, also in India. But they went. With the train, by train. Yeah, but then later they to... flew back to India to get Kamal Khan. When the journey oh, part yes. was over. Yeah. Yeah, to raid his castle. Um, but, what did you think of, of... Well, talk about the locations. Did they represent India well? There were a lot of stereotypes, of course, with the guy with the knife and the snakes yeah. and the coals. But, how did you like it? They um, put out all the things of India. Yeah. Yeah. Lots of animals too. Lots of animals, the Taj Mahal, the things that people do there in India with the sword and the uh, needle bed. Yeah. They call it like that. Mm -hmm. And the snakes and like the the tune of James Bond that he yeah. knew it was. It's kind of a fort walking, a uh, yeah. fort wall breaking joke. I and Bond shouldn't recognize that in his universe, but it's like a charming tune. So it's, but, it's funny. yeah, he had to know that it was him. I think. Yeah, yeah. That's like the that was code his that was his anything. code. Yeah. Yeah, and that Q was also there in India. Yeah. And then they went to Berlin. Yeah. You see the West and East Berlin there. Yeah. yeah. Now, I'm glad you uh, you gave the locations for stars, so we should move on to the story in Octopussy. What did you think? I gave it two stars. Ah, only two stars. Yeah. Such a shame. Some some people will be broken hearted probably by this. I'm so but sorry. <laughs> no, 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 this is your rating. T talk about the story. So I guess you weren't the biggest fan, maybe? No, all the other movies from, um, what's his name, Mr. Moore? Roger Moore. Roger yeah. Moore um, were quite better than this one. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> story wise, you mean? Story wise, <laughs> mm. yes, I think. Yeah, I see. Yeah, yeah. So you would much rather see a guy that wants to turn the water, the underwater world, instead of a realistic guy that wants to blow up the West with a bomb and NATO versus. I mean, this is well, much that more was realistic. At the end. That, the, yeah, that's throughout right. the whole movie, it was about the Fabergé egg and all the diamonds and everything. That's right. Not about the bomb. The bomb I, uh, I only saw in the end. Yeah. And in the beginning when they talked about it. You're right, Fabergé Egg also played a big part in Octopussy. Um, so is there a reason you, you didn't think, did you think this is a weaker story compared to the other? Uh, what, what makes it weak in your eyes, I mean? Um, well, it's not like the one with, uh, with the moon. Yeah, I, um, I, I, it's still her favorite, Moonraker. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I remember that movie like it was yesterday. Yeah. Like, Oh. That's very memorable. Then. Yeah. And when he wants to take a, take out the human race. Yeah. If you ask me tomorrow about this movie, the story, I don't know. I I only know the locations, I think, and the and the girls and bones. Yeah. It will. But this story, this is less memorable to you. Yes. I think only the Faberge egg. <laughs> if you ask maybe me tomorrow. Maybe maybe you remember the part where Bond drives an Alfa Romeo. She's gonna forget about that. You liked that. You liked that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But um, <laughs> part of the movie. Yeah? So yeah, I did. Um, fair enough. Anything more you want to mention about the story? No. Okay. No. So hopefully you did have a good, decent enjoyment of Octopussy. Yes, what did you I give? did. I gave it three stars. Three stars for her enjoyment, which is definitely good. I think. Yeah. Uh, very, very above average. You know. 
kind That's of average. Average, I yes. Think, yeah. Yes, yeah, so um, talk about what you enjoyed about this film. Well, there were a lot of animals. <laughs> yeah. Not only in real life, but also kind in of the Indiana, place. Indiana Jones stuff, right? <laughs> yeah. When you ran into the woods, he was like into <laughs> spider webs. Yeah. <laughs> um, what else? He had like a lot of chases on trains, airplanes. And the tuk tuk in uh, India. And the Alfa Romeo, the tuk tuk. Yeah. Tuk, 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 tuk. And of course the brilliant opening with the Aqua Star plane. Yes, with the plane out of the horse ride. Um, yeah, the cart. Cart. I knew it was fake. You knew it was the a butt fake of horse. The horse. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I didn't know that there was an airplane coming out of it. No, you were like, there's a car coming out, and it's shh. You see the nose of the plane come out with with the Dutch flag on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, you said that. Yeah. No, but um, I'm glad you liked it. It's a brilliant opening, Octopussy. It has nothing to do with the rest of the movie, but it's so much fun, that opening. Yeah. And especially, fill her up, please. You know, at a gas station. Oh yes. Uh, there were a, a s slides of faults in this movie, I said. Oh, of course there were, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Like, what, like <laughs> how, did the, how did the bad guys swim through the crocodile yes. lake and stuff? Yeah. Yes, yeah. Hmm. That's also so weird because when they were fighting, they were crocodiles. Yeah, they immediately like got that. killed by them. Yeah. yeah. So weird. But he was like sleeping in a bed of octopus. Like it was an octopus. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's. Uh, I'm glad you like this film. Um, uh, this, which brings us to your average score, of, which is. Three stars for Octopussy. Uh, a bit lower than some of the previous ones, really? but also still high enough. It will translate to a six. So that only leaves one more Roger Moore movie, A Few to a Kill. But, and this is something which could be interesting for the comments, in 1983, of course, two Bond films came out because Sean Connery returned in the unofficial Never Say Never Again, the remake of Fundable which you weren't the biggest fan of, and now he's even older, Never Say Never Again came out. Now, it's an unofficial Bond film. Let us know in the comments, should Lirit and I watch Never Say Never Again as well as part of the movie reaction series next time? Let us know. What is, what is your own thought? Would, are you interested in seeing a one unofficial Bond film that came out in the same year as this? So it's not in these twenties? No, it's not on this poster. Well, why? Um, it's a long story, but it's the producer that had the rights to Fundable, Kevin McClory. I talked about it when we filmed Fundable, and he wanted to get Sean Connery to, f to use his rights again. He had the rights that, to Spectre and all the things that the, the official movies couldn't use anymore after a couple of years. And he wanted to film Fundable again. Uh, with Sean Connery to go up against the official series with Roger Moore. So they were like a rival company. I could tell you a much more detailed version, but this video would be too long. But are you <laughs> interested in watching it, is the story? It's, it's similar to these kind of movies. No, different, but it's, it's James Bond. And it's Sean Connery. It's an older Sean Connery, but it is still him. <laughs> Yeah. So well, I have to watch two movies. Um, well, we'll also see in the comments, but I think at least C wants to watch it, but I'm putting her on the spot, of course, <laughs> um, and we'll, we'll give it some time, time to think about it, but I'm, we're going to be seeing Never Say Never Again or A Few to a Kill next time. You'll see probably both, but you'll see. Uh, but let us know in the comments if Never Say Never Again is something you're interested in. I uh, hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time. Bye. A, a poll, yeah. Maybe a we poll. could do a poll on it too. Ooh.